from here, the Mercedes-Benz stall where today they have just launched the V-Class Marco Polo. What's so special about this? Loads. Let's take a look. At the outset, I'm probably wondering what is this that's extending out of the car? Well, it is an accessory that you can take along with you when you go camping and it rolls out really, really fast and you can set it up for a little patio outside your car. Now, why would you need a patio? Because this is just not a car. It's a way to go glamping in style. Let's take a look at what this extended roof actually means and why it is there. Yeah. So normally the roof is down, you can extend it up like this and I've kept it up just to show you what you can do in there. Uh, why don't you come in from here and let me tell you, take a look, there's a bed up there. Yep, there is a bed for two people, there is a sunroof as well. So you can take a look at the stars and just remember there is climate control. So you know, inside the car it's all controlled and I'll tell you how that's all going to function in just a bit. As you come inside, you can see that normally this is a four-seater car for the driver. The seat in front also turns around, so it is, you know, almost like a lounge. You can face the other way. We can have conversation with people when the car is stationary. There's plug points over there, as you can see, for things to charge. Now, you're wondering where the headrests have gone. Well, I've sort of pre-prepared this car to show you all its party tricks. I've tucked the headrests all the way back here which is where they go if you want to come round to the back. Uh, the headrests actually tuck behind the seats very, very neatly over there. And I've done that because I actually want to show you how the seats fold back. So all I have to do is pull the seats all the way. Well, let's show you this first. The seats go all the way back and you can make more room when it's just few people in the car. But when I want them to fold down, pull them all the way forward and then I just need to fold the seats all the way back. Yeah, let me just get them going. Takes a bit of time, but if you're patient, you will see exactly what that's for. And when you come around the back, all I have to do is tuck this little bit thing in here. I haven't quite made the seats level, but they do level out and become flat. Put your mattress and this is your bed. Now, not only is it your bed, but if you look up front, there is a little bit of a kitchenette over there. So you can cook your breakfast as well in the car. How does water and all that happen? I'm going to explain that to you in a bit. But meanwhile, let's check out the storage areas. There's one storage area that's right up here. Um, so space to keep stuff and a mirror. And you can actually even access it from here, place to hang clothes, keep your things on the inside, lots of storage areas. Let's come around the back so I can show you all about how the power and the water works. I'm discovering things as I go along. Uh, there is one more storage here, little pocket to put your things away. Now, if you come here, if you're sleeping inside the car, don't want to drain out your battery, there is a power socket, 220 volt that you can plug into an outside source to ensure that your car's running at night. You can have the heating on, you can have the AC on. There's also a filler tank over here. Now this filler tank is for fresh water, which you can put into the car, 38 liters of it. That's quite a lot. There's also a 40 liter wastewater tank in the car. So really, really stylish. Lots of more accessories that you can get with this. What are you going to have to shell out? Well, it starts at 1.38 crores for the V-Class Marco Polo and goes upward from there depending on how you accessorize. 